And there's a food truck park that's bringing different cultures and flavors together all in one spot. I like the sound of that. Clark had the chance to see how Golden Street Tacos is serving up toasted cheesy tortas just in time for your lunch break. Golden Street Tacos, and it is in a food truck lot right off of Warsbach. It's kind of close to the medical center and right across from Incarnate Word, their new building. But I'm so happy I'm hanging out with Jorge. He's the owner, and you guys make tortas here. Yeah, we do tortas, asada, or any kind of meat with melted cheese on the top, yes. Okay, oven. we're going to put together a torta. And so you already toasted it, but we're going to slice it. We're going to cut it in half, uh -huh. and, and we will open it to put the ingredients inside. Okay, so help me cut it in half, and while you're doing that, we can talk a little bit about this location. So you own this truck. What made you want to bring Mexican street food to this area? Because, you know, it's, uh, well, you don't have a lot of students around, mm -hmm. also as uh, hospitals, and uh, it's a good area to be right here. It's an excellent area to be right here. All right, so we just sliced this open. I love the crispiness. Are you kidding? You can hear it, the toastiness in the bread. All right, so that looks good. And then what is next? Next we're gonna do this torta, Mexican torta. It's gonna be refried beans on the, on the inside. Okay, so I'm gonna come over here and add the refried beans. And then everything that you make here is from scratch. You don't buy anything store-bought. No, I make everything by myself. All everything is, is fresh. Everything is by and made it by me. So. Yes, and so he makes the adobo. He adobo. makes all the different sauces and the salsas too. And you guys even have agua frescas as well, which is really cool. Yeah, it's so delicious. Agua frescas, fresh. The refried beans, and then after I put the beans on, what goes next? Uh, next will be the meat. The meat. Okay, so asada. you have the asadas. Asada steak. Okay, the steak is over here. So I'm gonna take some steak. Oh my gosh. And this is the asada that I like because it has the fat in it still. I feel like, I don't know, there's a lot of like lean asadas out here in San Antonio, but I really, you can tell there's a little fat, there's a little extra on there. Okay, so this is salsa made in house and it's a sweeter salsa too, which is awesome. Okay, okay. Oh man, yes. And, and after that you're gonna melt, so melt the cheese on top. Oh man, that looks so good. All right, so I'm just gonna get it like that and then put it on top. And it's so crispy. Are you kidding? You guys, yes. The cheese is gooey. See, I'm gonna start doing this at home because I try to melt it with the bread already on and it's just not happening for me sometimes. All right, avocado on top. And so the way that you sliced it was really cool. So I usually try to cut it with a, uh, a knife and it doesn't work out all the time for me. So let me see. All right, so you just kind of scoop it like this and then you layer it on top. I just broke mine in half, but that's okay. It's all about the flavor. It doesn't have to look perfect all the time. Jorge, where can people come see you if they want to try your food? Okay, we are right now located in 9501 Computer Drive and uh, have local good track in uh, I-10 highway. Right next to the freeway. So if you're getting ready to hit the road, you might want to hit up this spot because, oh my goodness. And of course, I'm going to take a bite. Is that okay? We're going to be very ladylike because, you know, we'd like to do that here on GDSA. Okay. 